I knew that it was something I wanted to do even when I was applying to law school. I wanted to make myself more marketable as a lawyer and I wanted to also improve my own skills as a lawyer. I learned quite a bit about writing and editing by virtue of being on the Law Review for two years. I knew that for the job opportunities that I wanted and for the um, career opportunities that I wanted that Law Review was something that I had to at least try for. I believe Law Review is essential to setting yourself apart. I felt that Law Review was probably the preeminent organization or award that one could get uh, at law school. I joined Law Review because I felt that you don't really have a lot of opportunity for uh, writing courses as an upper level law student and I wanted to improve my writing skills significantly and I thought that by joining the Law Review I have an opportunity to do that. Tackling Law Review teaches you uh, t even better time management uh, than the regular law school classes would require. One of the unique things about uh, Law Reviews is that they all across the country, whether it's at Harvard or the University of Memphis, they're student-run organizations, which is, makes them very unique. That means that law review students are the people who are editing the professors and the judges' articles, uh, who submit the articles to them, completely student-run organizations. I think it's one of stepping stone to, to career opportunities, and being on law review sets you apart from the others. It is the best of the best. So when future or prospective employers see that you were on Law Review, they know that you are willing to put in the time, the commitment, and the hard work. They also know that you have advanced skills, skills greater than most law students. So I think it does give you an edge in, in the hiring field, the hiring arena. What is so unique about Law Review is that everybody knows Law Review, and everybody knows that if you were on Law Review, that meant that you worked really hard, that meant that you really cared about your written work product, and that meant that you were very interested in the progress of law, because Law Review is more than just reading articles. Law Review is about understanding legal issues. I wanted to take advantage of every possible thing in law school. I was paying for it myself, and I was going to squeeze every little bit of education out of it. Why did I join the Law Review? I wish I had a better answer because I'm the faculty advisor to the Law Review, but my honest answer is probably a good one. My brother had to talk me into it. I didn't know why it was important. I didn't know how important it was. And I was lucky to have an older brother a few years ahead of me who said, are you out of your mind? Of course you're going to do Law Review. And so uh, for all of the people that don't have an older brother like mine, I will just say, that would be my answer to them too. Are you out of your mind? Why wouldn't you want to do Law Review? So that's why I did it. And I'm glad I did. Law Review is important. In fact, I think most, if not all of those firms that come in and interview students, what they call the on-campus interviews, require Law Review. So I was certainly thrilled uh, that I had Law Review and I subsequently ended up working for that firm out of law school. You generally are never going to have a situation in a law firm where you're the only one who's writing something. Generally there's going to be a senior partner or another attorney who's going to look at it, who's going to weigh in on it. And the, the process of working with the notes editor, of the collaborative process of producing work product that is your own, but that you have constant feedback and input to make it better, to make it clearer, um, that was something that was new to me and that I hadn't experienced yet. And it was um, something that helped me later on um, not get quite so sensitive if you get feedback or input it's part of the process. I think the thing that I've benefited most from from Law Review is learning sources. The most important thing for me is not to know the answer, it's to know where to go. On Law Review you just get tremendous experience with knowing where to look and knowing what you're looking at. Um, there's so many legal sources and to, to kind of have them cabined off in your head in different areas is very beneficial and incredibly important to my job now as a clerk and I know it will be next year as an associate at a firm. Better writing skills, better organizational skills, citation skills, but maybe the most important lesson I learned on Law Review that really helped me and what I see that really distinguishes the best law students and the best lawyers from the others is the, learning the importance of attention to even the smallest of details. As an AUSA, we spend a lot of time uh, writing and responding to motions. We also uh, respond to uh, appeals that uh, criminal defendants 
may file and so the law review helped me to improve my research skills so that I'd be able to hone in on the exact issue that needed to be responded to. It also made, helped me to um, be clearer in my writing uh, because I'd had so much practice and it also helped me with respect to understanding citations and blue, book, blue booking and covering that information. Uh, so it has been very helpful for me in my current position as an AUSA. Working on law review while being involved in other activities is a challenge, but if you are not ready for a challenge or if you are afraid of a challenge, then you, you probably are looking into the wrong profession. I feel like that I would not have been, become a magistrate judge had it not been for the judicial law clerk. And I do not think that I would have gotten a judicial law clerk uh, position had I not been on law review. Without law review, I literally would not have been eligible for all three of my major legal jobs. Uh, federal district court judges generally only hire people who are on law review. My law firm only interviewed people who were on law review. Every single member of the firm was a member of the law review. And as you might imagine, most law professors were on law review. So it really defined and changed my whole career trajectory. I do require some type of law review or journal experience. And the reason is, is that 90% of the work of a federal law clerk is research and writing. Plus, they have to edit my opinions. Everything we write is published. So it has to be in final form. There can be no errors. You really do truly become friends that way. So people that I never would have interacted with in class because class just really isn't conducive to that kind of interaction I was interacting with in law review. So for me, that was a, a significant plus. I have the privilege of getting to work with the editorial board members and the staff members. And I can tell you that it's really one of the greatest privileges of my career is being able to work with what I, who I affectionately call the law review kids, even though uh, most of them are not kids. They, to me, define what it means to be a smart, hardworking, dedicated person. They're well-rounded people. You just couldn't find a better group of people to associate with. And that, like I said, it, I consider it a true honor and privilege to be able to work with them as the faculty advisor each year. By virtue of the fact that you're on law review, you meet practitioners, you meet judges, you meet um, others as, you know, part of the different activities that, that we do. Um, and that gave me an opportunity to get to know, uh, in particular, Judge Vescovo, um, who I then interned for. When I look back on Law Review as, a, as an organization, I think of the people that I did it with, you know, and the people that uh, we were up late or, or uh, just grinding out work uh, during, the, during the day. Um, just what a tremendous experience that was uh, being a part of essentially a team, you know. If you love, uh, if you love team sports or if you love uh, working with others towards a common goal, I think uh, there's nothing like it in law school. You don't know what life is going to bring. You don't know what your career is going to bring going forward. This is a feather in your cap you can only get now and it's going to open doors for you. I guarantee it's going to open doors for you because it opened doors for me. And I'm sitting here today talking to you about this really because I was on Law Review 24 years ago. Just because you weren't Law Review, it doesn't mean that it won't translate, you won't become an excellent attorney. And just because you are Law Review doesn't mean you will become an excellent attorney. But I certainly think it gives you a basis, a foothold, and it certainly gets you in the door. I've always said that, uh, you know, I'd rather have the key and not need it than to need a key and not have it. And that's to me what Law Review is, it, it's a key.